video has now gone viral on social media in which La Ganesan, the governor of Manipur and West Bengal pushes away Sunil Chetri for obstructing his view for a photo op during an award ceremony. In fact, Jairam Ramesh of the Congress party has now hit out at the Bengal governor for hogging the limelight and pushing away Bengaluru uh, FC captain. Uh, of course, these visuals are... Uh, live and in fact viral on social media. My colleague Shogata joins me on the broadcast. Shogata, pretty evident there that Mr. Ganeshan has decided to ask Mr. Chetri to give way so that he can be viewed in the photo opportunity more. And of course, the Congress is leaving no stone unturned to uh, accuse him for doing just that. Well, you see, uh, the incident uh, took place uh, during uh, the award ceremony of the Durant Cup uh, final, uh, which took place at the Salt Lake Stadium in Kolkata yesterday. And uh, Bengaluru FC um, won the trophy, and uh, Sunil Chetri, uh, the captain of the Bengaluru FC team, uh, was obviously on the dais uh, mm -hmm. to collect uh, the prize when Governor uh, uh, L.A. Ganesan uh, uh, was, uh, was the chief guest and was, uh, was supposed to give away the trophy uh, to the winning captain. Um, uh, what we see is, uh, uh, you know, an interesting visual that has now gone viral mm. on social media where, uh, uh, where uh, the governor, who's on additional charge of, uh, of, the Bengal, uh, of Bengal as well, after, uh, you know, uh, after uh, Governor Jagdeep Thankar stepped down after, you know, on account of he becoming the vice president of the country, um, uh, La Ganesan uh, was, uh, was there, Governor Ganesan was there, mm. and uh, we can see a slight nudge that he gives uh, to, uh, to um, uh, you know, uh, Sunil Chetri, mm. uh, so that he could uh, be properly seen uh, in the photograph. And this was obviously uh, during the photo session uh, when the prizes were being given away. Um, you know, this has not gone down well with the football fans, obviously, um, uh, who have uh, criticized the governor uh, for trying to hog the limelight uh, instead of the real hero um, of, the, of the ceremony, which obviously was the captain of the Bengaluru FC team, Sunil Chetri. And and, uh, and that, obviously, as you rightly pointed out, has now assumed political colors as well, where uh, senior uh, Congress leader mm. and spokesperson of the party, uh, Jairam Ramesh, has hit out, um, you know, uh, for, for uh, you know, for, for political, uh, uh, obviously, for, for political ends. And, uh, and uh, it remains to be seen whether the governor's office is, uh, is coming out with any kind of a clarification on this. Uh, but, yes, the, the issue uh, from the arena of sports have now uh, moved on to the arena of polit politics, mm. which normally happens uh, to be a case uh, when 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 any such incident happens in Bengal, right. and uh, and uh, and one of you know that slight nudge mm. that uh, the governor gave to the footballer uh, to to come in front and 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 hog the uh, photograph frame uh, was not taken kindly by the uh, by the football right. fans. Shagata, let me take this across to Mr. Kirti Azad of TMC, who is also joining us on the broadcast. So thank you so much for being a part of this conversation on CNN News 18. What do you make of this body language by the governor in the state? Well, that's a very shameful act, especially if you have uh, governors who are appointed who don't have much knowledge about what the entire system in the country is all about. Mm. You're bound to find such things. And I don't know who he gets inspired by to get in front of the camera. If Sunil Chetri is a world-renowned football player. Yes. He's, he's all respected by us. I am a sportsman. I know that too. Mm. When we won the World Cup, uh, Kapil Dev was handed the cup and everybody else moved and the entire team was together. We are, these politicians and governors are wanting to come into, you know, and forcing players away is absolutely shameful. I mean, whatever you say is very little, whichever mm. way you criticize it. Sharbanak. Mm. That's all I can. And Mr. Azad, in fact, this was his uh, day in the uh, in the spotlight. And Sunil Shetri, we've always known him to be of a calm demeanor. He's never been one to brag about uh, his achievements. And the way he was just shoved aside really was very, very shameful. That's absolutely well put. I know. I, uh, that, what what else do you expect? Mm. I mean, when you have politicians or their kids coming into the game, mm. you will find that they don't basically know. I mean, sports is an etiquette. It, 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 it is not bound by any region, religion, caste, creed. It's a sport, you know. And uh, one should realize that these sportsmen are basically mm. the ambassadors for your state, for your team, for your country. Mm. And hence, acting like this shows the kind of uh, immaturity this governor had. Mm. And he doesn't know what the world is all about. Right. Mr. Azar, thank you so much for joining us on the broadcast. We'll leave it at that. And we'll